Hi, ladies. I'm so sorry about the technical difficulties. I know we're like 25 minutes late, but we have Angie in the house. Hello, everybody. And she's going to be, um, you know, making this kit with us because she ordered one of these beautiful kits from Rose as well. Okay. So she's going to be creating this kit with us. So I'm just, hi, Debbie. Thank you so much, you guys, for bumping on over to my channel. Sorry we had the technical difficulties with Lorelli's channel. She's, um, well, it's not really with her channel. Her just, they're having a really bad windstorm, I think, right now. And so it's a little crazy over there. Yeah, it's a little windy and stuff, and she can't get, you know what I mean. Anyways, but <laughs> she can't get her <laughs> stuff going. But, um, yeah, I'm seeing it. I hope Laurel. Hi, Autumn. I hope Laurel can make it over here. So I'm just going to go ahead and start Hi, by showing the pieces in the <clears throat> kit. And hopefully Laurel will show up by then. So anyways, um, this is the thank you gift that you get for buying the kit. And you get all these beautiful images to use in your project. And you can fussy cut them all out. I probably should have thought about that before we started, but I wanted to wait to open my kit so I didn't lose any of the pieces. So all these beautiful images are part of the kit, and um, it's a little thank you gift from Rose. And then um, what the main kit is, it's called a flip box. You know, it's not a flip book, and it's not a exploding box. It's a flip box. So... That's what the main part of the kit is. And, oopsie. Anyways, um, th this is the flip box. And so how it opens is you open it right, left, top, bottom. So you can see the longest one is on the right so that goes on the very top so you how you fold up is bottom top left right and you can see it folds up like a box okay and this was an original idea from rose and oh there's laurel and Yay. we are going to go ahead and um make this so <clears throat> Of course, if you guys choose to, you can always make something different um, than what the original purpose for the kit was. But you can also make the, the actual flip box. And I think that's what me and Laurel are going to make. And Angie's going to, you know, make whatever she wants. And I'm sure they all will turn, they all will turn out completely different. Mm -hmm. So, um, Laurel is going to have in about five seconds. You're going to have a kid in a kitchen? A conniption in about five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm I thought she was going to have a kid in. I was excited. I want I want the kid in. I'm not a happy camper at the moment. She can't get her internet to work right. No, it's working fine now. I don't oh. know what the problem was. Oh, well. Oh, well. Already. We lost hey. half the people. I hope hey, everybody Carrie. saw the message. Mine is still up over there, so... Yeah, I just turn wanna, it off. Turn it I know, off but around. I want to go to the chat and make sure that everybody uh, jumped right over. Yeah, I shared it all. And so also in this kit, you get this really super sweet Chinese braid. And I've never seen Chinese braid this skinny before. It's so sweet. It is really neat. I like that. It's like it's like itty bitty. Mm -hmm. It's like Angie size Chinese braid. This and is like Angie size, right? <laughs> yep. This little kit is perfect. Yes. And then you get these two beautiful colors. It looks almost like a, now that I see the color, I can see the green that Laurel was talking about. But it looks almost like a gold and a mossy green. And I don't know. I saw like a reindeer green or mossy green, yeah. Yeah, it's really sweet color. <clears throat> and then you also get some tags. And everything's, sorry for all the crinkling. Everything's all packaged up <laughs> so nice and neatly. 
you get these beautiful tags and she actually gives you cardstock backing to put on the tags as well so that's super cool oh. so you can make the tags super thick or you can just make multiple tags too Gigi say too. Cool. so you get all these tags which are nice I think I got an extra heart. Oh, I got an extra heart. Thank you, Rose. Mm -hmm. You got an extra heart? I think yeah, I, I got, got an extra, extra heart, heart, too. Yeah, we oh. all got an extra heart. <laughs> okay. We okay, we all got heart. an extra heart. I'm not spoiled. <clears throat> and then all these sweet accessories. We got a strand of flatback pearls. Yeah, I know. That braid is really cool. Talk, Ask Rose. Maybe she can share her. Then we got some of this cool fabric, which is always nice to layer and mm -hmm. use. And we got just a whole bunch of goodies. And we got some flowers. This flower is oh so sweet. And so is this flower. We got some of these flowers and we got a few more flowers. Oh, we even got a little piece of rhinestone. So we're all set. So we got all these. Hi, Rose. Little oh, hi, Rose. Hi, Judy. Hi, Judy. Oh, hi, Carrie. Little... Hi, Autumn. Hi, I'm sorry, ladies, for the problem. Uh, I don't know what was little going on. Tiny in flowers. Look at those. those it was not. Nice. It was not being nice tonight. More itty bitty things. Look at those little tiny flowers. They're so <laughs> sweet. <laughs> Love and them. They're gonna be perfect to put in like the hair on the picture, and then these blingy things. And this little. Yeah, I'm so excited. Yeah, I'm putting all mine into a little cup. Hmm. Yeah, I put mine into a little cup too. Yeah, I I don't want to have to keep digging that out of the bag. That sounds like a mighty good idea. I'm putting my Hi Joy. You also get stamens and buttons and bows and you just got everything you're gonna need. I'm putting all my stuff in back in the bag until I start embellishing. And I fussy cut most of my stuff today. Oh, I just have, well, you're I just have on one thing left then. to fussy cut. <laughs> <laughs> Lorel's on point here. Yes, I yeah. am. So since she's already, we'll flip to her as soon as I show the rest of the kit. You get this really nice. Oh no, you we don't have to we don't have to go to me. I'm I'm good over here. I'm just trying to get things set up so I can see. These little, I don't know where you get some of this stuff, but I really would. I know. I love all the tiny, like these little tiny, I don't know, little plastic flowers. Hi, Judy. Yeah, my kits, um, there is still <coughs> a couple available, the kit that I showed today on my, oh, we're still on my channel. Yeah, so my kit is, I still have a couple available. So just PM me if you're interested. But anyway, so in Rose Kit also comes with these little stamens. And so okay, and then also you get these laces, and she gave you enough stuff to just decorate. Hi, Joyce. Okay. I'll get back to you after the show then, Judy. Thank you. Um, so here is this right here. And this really sweet applique. A beautiful peach rosette doily. Some crochet trim. I love crochet trim. And another piece of lace. All these little bits and bobs. Bits and, and then bobs. we come to the main part, and that's where we're going to start. Um, Judy, so, we're working on a kit that Rose Alcala created. Um, ha hashtag or whatever, Rosie Posey. Um, I believe she still has a couple hashtag. of them. Left. <laughs> 
I don't even know what word I want to use. AKA. I'm sorry, guys. It's been a crazy <laughs> day. Um, <laughs> but I believe she has a couple of them up. Please don't laugh at me. I'm having a rough day here. I know. And I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't think of the word I want to use. Yes. AKA. So Rose still has some kits left. The kit I just showed, this is Rosie Posey's kit. And she does have a couple kits left, I believe. Rose, if you can write how many kits you have left. And they are $25, including shipping within the U.S., not outside of... No, not including Alaska, Hawaii, or Puerto Rico. Did you say Puerto Rico? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so Laurel, how are we supposed to start? Yeah. Um, so yeah. I'm going to click on Laurel. So yeah. we're we're going to entrust me to the to this. Huh? Yeah. I'm. I okay. don't even know what I'm doing, Laurel. So you got to help me. <laughs> yeah, All we right. got. We need some help here. Well, I know All kind right. of what I'm doing, but. I wanted to see what you're doing first. So okay. aren't we covering this with fabric, not paper, right? Yes, this gets covered. This gets covered with fabric. Just make sure you open your box and look yeah. at it and make sure that you have the widest one to your left. Okay. Because that because remember it goes top, bottom, right, left when it closes. So it once you Put your fabric and stuff on if you don't do it the right way and have the longest end on the left then we'll have problems but so look at the so mine closes like, like this is that not that, right then hold mine on closes like this Let should i see. cut well, that it's little gonna have, off? it's gonna have some bulk right now yeah that's wrong open your box back up but see it's wrong see if i do that then it does that no it goes the biggest end goes last so it yeah, go so it goes like this. Top, bottom, but there's right, a little bit left. left extra. Isn't there a little bit extra at the yeah, side? Yeah, but yours right should here? be on the top, not at the bottom. Flip it over. Well, yeah, I know. I'm okay. Just okay. Yes, but that's because once we start putting on material and stuff, that that it's is giving get room. Right, that's giving room for all the material and everything. So is okay. mine okay then, Laurel? So let me see. Top, bottom, right. right. Left. left that's exactly right okay just like that so that's how you just want to lay and then it down if you squeeze it together just make sure that there's a little the uh, it the yeah. little tab yeah, comes that's out. right okay all right so yeah. now i would take just for now so in case we move them i'm gonna I would put take, arrows right i'm gonna take a little pencil and go one two three okay four that's perfect okay. one two three. so i know so top Bottom, right, left, right, left. Two. Right, left. Two. three, four. Okay, three, perfect. Four. Okay, all right. I got mine labeled too. All right, so we're covering both the front and the back, correct? With fabric, right? Laurel, yes, I, I believe so. Um, I would need Miss Rosie Posey to send me a picture. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, she showed it to us finished, but she never, you know, we didn't sit and make one together to go over like. Good night, Deb. Oh, good night. I don't know if we should cut the squares because my thing, I was thinking about it today. Like Shoot. if I laid this down and just put fabric on. When I go to close it, isn't it going to pull it tight? I guess not. I, guess, I was worried that it would pull everything tight. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a little space mm -hmm. on mine all the way around and then just kind of cut the corners here just so if I need to fold it over, okay. I can. Or or if I need a little extra room, I'll have it. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So okay. Rose has um, three kids left, and it looks like... Uh... So again, this is twenty five dollars ship. Judy Evans might may, maybe getting one. That's awesome. So, thank you. hi Tori, welcome. Hi, Tori, thanks hi, so much. Hi Tori. For so the the uh, rose pattern goes on the hi, back. Tori. Well, it depends, I guess. It depends if you want the rose pattern on the front or on the outside or on the inside. Okay. So I yeah, I want I want my rose. Sorry. Sorry. Mm -hmm. 
<clears throat> yes. I might I want my other one on the outside. I got to see. I might want this one on the outside. Which one? Yeah, that's what I was then I can. Walking. I don't know what I. The solid one, because then I can do. Oh, it actually has that beautiful pattern on it. That those flowers. So I might yeah, actually want that on the like outside. Silk embroidered. So. And I'm gonna kind of place mine, where I can get a lot of that flower in there. That one big flower. So oh, this is okay. We gotta flip it. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna come around the bend. But I wonder if we, Rose, do we just take the whole, you can do whatever you want with it. You do not need to anything to it, just glue to the material down. All right, okay. so she must, so you must have used the whole piece, Rose. You didn't cut little squares or anything. You used the whole piece. Um, Hadassah. Hi, Hadassah. Thank you so much for our Daisy. Thank you so much for joining us today. Um, so this is going to be the top. This is where I want this is on the top. So, so Rose, um, honey, I'm so sorry that you can't be here. Um, Joyce, I'm sorry. So Rose has the finished product. Uh, unfortunately, she's very sick and was unable to come on um, today. So we don't have the finished product. We're just working on it as we go. So sorry about that. But we'll, we'll have, I mean, we're going to go until we're done, though. So we'll have the finished product. You know what? I found what else rusts, <laughs> how you can rust stuff. You if, what? You stick, oh, if, you stick, if you pour a bunch of glue on it, it'll rust. See this pin I put in the top of my glue bottle? It's all rust. It, it's all rust. Yeah, rusted. <laughs> well, that's a good one. That's a good one. But I don't know why. I actually might want to take. I might want to take another extra piece of this and cut it afterwards because I want that picture on the top of my thing. So. I think I'm gonna do the fab the the cotton fabric on the outside. Yeah, wow. that's what I'm, I'm actually going to not even actually, use, I'm going to just use my own linen, just <clears throat> um, some, just regular linen on the outside, because I want to make a flower out of this. Yeah, I'll use this. I think I'm going to use this on the outside. Yeah, I think so too, because, and then I'm going to cut a piece of this and yeah. put it on the front cover, because I want that, I want that rose. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to put the cotton there. on the outside and then do something different. Okay. What are you using mm -hmm. for glue, Lorelli? I'm going to use my fabric tack. Fabric tack. Man, I was going to use that, but I'm like almost out. I'm just going to use my regular tack glue. But yeah, so I'm just going to use some regular um, uh, muslin that I have. And it's nothing special. It's just... Mm -hmm. I'm going to glue mine down and then cut it out, I think. Muslim. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, you're the seamstress in here, Laurel. Yeah. <laughs> it just makes more sense that way to me. And we can switch to somebody else, Sierra. We don't have to stay on me here. Well, I'm, I'm doing the same thing you're here. doing. <laughs> I'm just tearing fabric. I should have thought this out a little bit, but I was just like, you know, this kit is so complete. I can just pull it and use it and we'll be good. But it's a good kit. Rose says, do not glue. No little squares, just glue down fabric around the edges. No glue mm -hmm. around the folds. Oh, don't put glue on the on No the glue folds. around the folds? Well, great. Yeah, She's telling me that now. I already put glue all over the folds. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay. Ladies, do not glue around the folds of the box. Just around the... Hey, Rose, is there any way you can talk? Can we call you on speakerphone or something? Because uh, what I'm confused of is she is she telling us to like fold the fabric in so it gives it a finished look. That's like what I'm that. gonna do. That's why I said I'm gonna leave an edge on mine. Oh, 
So maybe that's what we have to cut it first. That's why I'm gluing it down first, and then I will cut it out, and I'm going to leave an edge where I cut it. You know what I'm saying? I know what you're saying. Yeah. But I'm scared now. I don't know what to do. <laughs> don't be scared. Uh, look at that. Uh, stick, look at that. Uh, snippet roll you created there was nothing to be yeah. scared of <laughs> yeah i think i'm gonna be making mine completely different because i'm just gonna be ripping fabric to put over it so all right so i hope that's what she meant by don't put glue here glue on where these, oh, okay on these little pieces that would be the folds to me okay yeah, the, the, the scored pieces don't put glue on the scored yeah pieces. okay because you want the fabric to um have some <gasps> give Mama Leaf is in the house. Hi, Leaf. Leaf. How are you? This is Mama Leaf. <laughs> I call her Mama Leaf. Oh, I'm going to call you Mama Leaf now. Yep. She's our mama. Mama Leaf is in the house. Well, she can't be my mama, so I'll just, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little too old for her to be my mom. Oh. Leafa. Ladies, read what Rose said. What did she say? Yes, we did. Do not glue around the fold the folds of she the box. She said no, we can't call her. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, thanks anyways. <laughs> All right, let's see. So this is from three to four. It is three and a quarter oh, yeah, inches perfect. verse. 11 and a half okay rose did you did you leave the folds they don't no folds they don't listen judy thank you <laughs> um rose did you leave a little space around the edges to fold it in or did you cut it right to the edge of the box okay. yeah that's what i just did i just tested mine out and seen <laughs> Yeah, I did the same thing <laughs> just to make sure it would all fold, <laughs> and it did. And then that tells me where I need some more glue. Leafa says you're not too old, Laurel. Oh, I'm. See, she keeps thinking I'm super young. <laughs> Laurel's fifty-six. Or 50, I am three, not fifty-six. 53. Stop it. She's fifty-three. <laughs> She's fifty-three. Um, she said yes. You can call me. Okay, get her on the phone. <laughs> Laurel, are you able to do that? I don't even have her number. I yeah, mean, I I'm, I'm using my phone. So if you can call, I can put call. Her on call it. I'm yeah. Your phone. Okay. I'm calling you now, Rose. I'm not going to cut mine until she tells me to. I yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm not cutting mine. It's going to wait. <laughs> I'm jumping ahead of the game and I already did it wrong. <laughs> Well, at least it folds. All right, let's see what she says. Yes, Laurel. Hi, Miss Rose. <laughs> How are you doing, sweetie? I am not good. No, I'm sorry. I'm so I'm sorry. sorry. All right, so did you leave? Okay, listen and listen good, okay? Okay, listen, guys, and listen good. Okay. This is how you do it. It's very simple. I don't know why you girls are having a hard time with it. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. You do not want to glue the material around the score lines. Okay. Because that's right. what's going to make it not want to fold. Okay. Right. Okay. And then also, if you're going to use the braid trim, you do not need to fold over the, the fabric. Okay. Okay. The okay. Just cut around it, and then you'll okay. You use your um your trim. Okay. Yeah, the you can use the braid to the cover. cover. You know. Oh, edges. that's right. That so trim is to cover it. it. Right. I remember that's why now. I gave you all that all that trim. Okay. Okay, and um. Sorry, Rose. Uh, sorry, we're good. Tell the ladies that they can distress the the, uh, the box if they like. They can paint it. They can gesso it. They can uh, use um, the, the chalk paint. Okay. Very yeah. lightly, so that way the box doesn't get you know wet and you know how they get when cardboard gets wet. Right. Gets wet. Yeah. 
stands and it doesn't look good. Right. So almost with a bright, uh, with a dry brush. Okay. So yeah, basically, ladies, you can do anything you would like to the to your box if you purchase the no, kit. Say it the way I told you. <laughs> you can yeah. you can distress it. You can paint it with chalk paint with a dry brush so you don't wet your cardboard. You can cover it with material. You don't have to fold it over because this braided trim is to cover all the edges. So you do not have to fold it inward. So actually, you can you can use the fabric or you can just cut it up or you can and you can. Do, do you can make uh, flowers with it? You can do anything, can and you can also cover this with paper, do. whatever you want to mm -hmm. do. You know, so Rose. it's up to you how you want to use the stuff in the kit. Hey Rose, would you Very mind diverse. sending me sending me a picture in Facebook so I can see your finished um, one? Angie wants to know if you can send her a picture on Facebook so she can see your finished one. I can send it to her later because I don't have a picture right now. Okay, I can't okay. okay, that's okay. Right Rose. Yeah, and she wants it everybody to make it different. Okay. okay. Right. She wants everyone to make it different. So okay. Yeah. okay. Thank you. All right. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Rose. Questions. Love you. I'll feel better you. soon. Love you. Feel better, okay? Thank you. Thank okay. You. Bye bye, Rose. Bye bye. Have fun. Bye bye. <laughs> All right, guys, have fun. Let's stop <laughs> overthinking this and let's just have All some right. fun, okay? Right. Yeah. This kit is amazing. Let's just have some fun with it. All right. That's right. So, so Laurel, so I'm just so, um, you know, we just are all want to make it perfect for Rosie because this is a beautiful right. for kids. Yeah. So, so yes, and. um, since I didn't get to see the picture and everything, so this is just this is a we're making the we're decorating a box to hold things in it. Well, no, because okay. so it's it can, you can put a picture or a charm or something not really thick, probably no thicker than like this. Okay, or okay. let's say in you there. could put like. You know what I'm planning on doing? I'm planning on putting, um, you can put like a pin cushion in the very middle. So do okay. you know what an exploding box yes. looks like, Angie? Yes. Yes. So what this is, is um, it's like taking a flip book and exploding box together. So okay. what you're doing is you're going to be just decorating, just decorating the front, the, the mm -hmm. inside and then the outside. And then after you're done decorating that, then what you can do is you can put pictures or little sayings on every okay. little flip that flips out and you okay. can put embellishments. And then in the middle, you can put like a little pocket to stick something in there, like a little Valentine or a gift, or you can make like a pin cushion or you could okay. make a flower or anything. Take these tags and you could make little pockets and stick these tags in them. Yeah. Okay. I got you now. Okay. All right. Now okay. Are we ready to have fun now? Yeah. I'm ready. Okay. All right. And of course, my internet hasn't gone out once now. <laughs> yeah. My dang computer. All right. I need a better. See, that's why mine. Too. I'm not even gonna. I'm gonna use. I'm just. I want the edges to be icky like this. Or not icky, but you know what I mean. All right. Gotcha. I'm just going for it. I'm just going for yep. it too. Here we go. Exactly. Here we go. Take off. We're <laughs> like bizarre bark. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I watch too many kids' programs. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Can you tell I have a child? Hey, Rose. Um, Judy wants you to um write out your Facebook name. It is R O S E. And then, can you spell her last name, Laurel? A L C A L A. And that's her Facebook name. And she. Right. I, does she have a picture on there of like. A, um, yeah, of that doll dress form. Yeah, it's of a dress form. And she lives in California, like Ontario, I think it's called. Ontario, California. If you go to any of our pages, Judy, she's all of our friends. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So this is, I mean, I love this kit because it's like a brand new project. You've never, I've never made anything ever right. like this. Yeah, me neither. So.
So I, mean, I need a little bit of uh, insight and then I can. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. So it's pretty much like a loaded box, but. No. So what I'm doing, also Dr. Morel. Okay, ladies. So what I am doing right now, I need a needle to poke. Let's Absolutely. let's switch to you, Sierra, so they can see what you're doing. I'm just cutting yep, fabric. That's what right I'm now. doing. That's okay. what I'm doing. Okay. So what I am doing, ladies, is I'm going to take my glue and I'm going to go around the edges. I'm first covering the outside of this box. And I'm going around the edges. I'm going to stay about an eighth of an inch or a sixteenth of an inch away from the score lines, like Miss Rose said. And this glue is not coming out good. I'm just squeezing away and it's not coming out. I hate when that happens. Sorry if this is loud. My plug is in right now. <laughs> okay. All right. So I'm again just going to be going around gluing all my, this glue is not working. <laughs> I may even take a glue stick. I don't know. I think Rose uses a lot of hot glue. So she may, we can ask if she used hot glue on this. We're just not big hot glue users. So. Why is this not coming out too well? Rose, did you use hot glue on yours? Or fabric tack? Yeah. So I know a lot of people love to know that. It's a lot of people love hot glue. Hi, Angela Velqua. Vel Vel yeah. Hello, Angela. How are you? Okay, there we go. Velasquez is her name. Hello, Angela. You called her Valpez. <laughs> I said Velasquez. <laughs> okay, so as you guys can see, I'm just kind of tracing my edges with this glue. I'm going to... Here's my little purple scissors on there somehow, even though I got to just bump my head and made everything shake. Slug to get the slime out. It's so hard. Is that a saying? It's like squeezing a slug to get the slime out. But you don't want to go over these. You don't want to glue on these. Um scored edges because you want that bend available you want that bend okay all right so now i'm just gonna just put some all right i feel like i've been on i've been on youtube Only all been day on you for a minute what? I haven't been on you that long. Oh, I know. No, I'm not I'm talking about it. I feel like I've been on YouTube all day since I did oh. like three lives. All right. Yep, that looks nice. I like it. I like it. I like it. I love it. I love and you're being awfully quiet over there. I was muted because I'm shredding right now. Oh, she's shredding. I'm shredding the edges. You know me, it has to be shredded. Right. Tattered. Has to be tattered. Rose is probably like, oh God, she's scraping that fabric. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. <clears throat> okay. All right. So I hope I got enough glue on it. I know that my glue is starting to dry, so I need to put this stuff on here. Okay. I don't know what I want to do here. Let me get all these bags out of the way so I can open all this stuff. Okay. 
Hi, Kim. Kim is here. Hey, Kim. Hi, Anastasia. Anastasia. Hi, Kim. Hi, Stephanie. How are you? Oh, hi, Steph. Hi, Joyce. Were you here before? I'm not sure if I'm saying hello anyway. I like to have all my stuff out and visible where I can see it so I know what I'm doing here. All right, what do I want to do on the inside? Because you know how I like to work backwards and cock it. Hey, where's my gold one? Uh-oh. Okay, so rather than Laurel and Angie, they are cutting the cross out of their mm -hmm. um, projects. I'm actually going to do it. I'm doing mine in two different pieces because okay. I'm going to actually make my this middle on the back actually a pocket. Oh, cool. Okay. Hey, that you works. know how we got this this green and the gold? My gold is missing. And I know I showed it when I showed the kit. Oh, yeah, you did. You did. You yeah. Did, you well, did. Where did it go? Because it's no longer here. I thought you put everything right back where it went. I did. That does not make any sense. Laurel loses everything, FYI. Yeah. Every five seconds, I lose something. <laughs> she needs one of those tiles on everything so she can just beep it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Ahead. Exactly. That's exactly what she needs. <laughs> just let me know if this scraping sounds too loud and I'll mute myself. Oh, you're fine. Okay. You're fine. Laurel is used to the scraping. I'm constantly scraping. Yeah, um, I am. I just uh, like fabric <laughs> tattered. I don't know. I don't know. I'd like to know where my gold uh, whatever Stop the it. thing is. Uh, what am I constantly doing, Lorelei? What? I'm constantly. I'm... Gosh, this glue is a pain in the rear. I will tell you. What am I constantly doing? I'm constantly uh, distressing. Distressing. Yes. yes, the cardboard. Constantly with the cardboard. I All right, mean... this doesn't make any sense. That my beautiful gold grew legs and vanished right you before my very eyes you so you took it on your desk uh, yeah it's not here hmm. i'm looking it's not there this is very nice the cardboard that rose has used to make the base for this so it's going to be very strong and again like rose said you can Rather than using the fabric that she provided on it, you can use your a different paper if you like, or you can use chalk paint, you can use any color paint, you can spray paint it. As long as something dry, you can Mod Podge it. You can just, if you like the craft board look, you can keep that and just distress it and ink it up. You can do anything to it. Anything type of project, which is nice. The anything goes type of project. Hi, uh, Angel. Oh. See, Rose, they don. They don. So, Rose, I'm they, shredding. No, like, see, Rose, they don't listen. <laughs> <laughs> I'm shredding the edges. I don't know if she can see that in the little square here. Somebody Angie just put Rose me out of my misery because Angie Rose wants to see it. Okay, we'll see what Rose is. Or we'll we'll switch to Angie. I lost my seam ripper. I've lost everything. Everything just is. I just don't understand where that could, that seam binding could have went. I put it all back the other day. And she is shredding the edges. You're not here. She's patterning. <laughs> it's not there. No, it's not here anywhere. On my seam ripper, I was just using brulee. I'm making shredded wheat. Shredding 
Nothing is safe. And get that weird thing. And so I'm only gluing on three sides. Mm. Oh, shoot. Mm. All right, who's getting the call? Yes, yeah, sorry, me. it's me. Mm. <laughs> I warned sorry, everybody. Guys, I I'm, oh, I'm thank you, Rose. I don't go to the camera yet. It's kind of what it's looking like right now. Okay, Judy. Oh, I like Hello. it. Okay, Judy. Thank you bye. so much for coming and joining us, Judy. I'll make sure to watch your show soon because I know you're going to come on live tonight, too. And everybody, make sure you sub each other. Sharing is hearing. So I'm see, glad Rose like likes blue. me shredding her material. <laughs> see, why does this happen to me? That's really oh, cool. Happening. Hello? Hello? She's on the phone. Oh, <laughs> oh it's no. me? No, I'm not on the phone. Oh, oh who my are you to? Oh, I was seeing because I could... Because someone called my phone and I was trying to, I can't answer because I'm on I'm videotaping. You're videotaping? <laughs> well, I'm recording. I'm on live. Oh, my God. I'm playing with a seam ripper right now. That's what I'm doing. Judy, Judy's husband's snoring right now, so she's going to have to wait. <laughs> she's there in a hotel. Oh, yeah. Judy, are you on vacation right now, honey? Okay. Right now, so I will have to wait. Oh, it's wait. looking so cool. Love that. I like it. I love it. I like I, I'm going to have to find some way to put some purple in mine or lilac or something. <laughs> oh, I'm sure you'll figure a way. You always do. You know me. You know, Look at this beautiful fabric I, I have, though, that I'm going to add to it. That's like the perfect color. Can you see it? So pretty. And then it's got this across the bottom. That is so pretty. I like that. Beautiful. All right. I think I, bought it. I think I bought it at the Goodwill for, I know it was half off, so it was three seventy five. so I paid a dollar something for it, I think. Um, I'm really upset that my old seam binding is uh, MIA. Your seam binding? And yeah, that gold one. It's missing. Hmm. And I don't know where it could be. It just doesn't make any sense. Well, not really. We went to a tractor show in Florida. Oh, a tractor oh, show. Okay. Okay, I have stopped for a quick break. Hello, back to you, Rose and Georgina. Yes, yeah, Steffi, Steffi, I was talking to her earlier, and she was driving in snow, like crazy weather. Oh, yeah. So she, drive, she drives the tractor as well? Yeah, she drives a big right. semi. Yeah, it's called a tractor trailer. A big yeah. rig or, you know. Rig. I'm so sorry, guys. She's our big rig girl. <laughs> She, uh, she's really cool. She, um, you know, she's on the road a lot and she doesn't have time to craft, but when she's done or when she's waiting for, you know, a load or whatnot, she, she crafts in her, um, in her, in her cab. So if you guys haven't seen any of her videos, you need to go watch them because they're really cool what she does with the time that she has. Okay. Mm 
Let me just don't get it. All right, I think I need some fabric, a different fabric for the inside, because I know what I want to use that other one for. Oh, this love-hate relationship with this fabric tech. Yeah, it always is, isn't it? It's, um, I don't know, snotty. It's like, or I don't know, slimy sometimes. But it's good stuff, though. Sure. Yeah, that's the truth. It is good stuff. And did Rose say that the um, the um, belt was for like to puff up the heart or something more or something or I can't she said or the images and stuff like that? The what? Or the images? Oh, okay, okay, gotcha. Okay. Yeah, you can put it behind the images, anything you want. Okay. Okay. So I'm not sure. Hmm. Still thinking on my neck. And I know this glue is probably going to show through this fabric I'm putting down, but that's okay because I am going to cover it with other stuff. I just want a base fabric down on my inside. Base material, I should say. Well, let's try this way. This way might work better if we do it like this. Yeah, these fabrics are so pretty. They really are. They're gorgeous. The rolling studio. Yeah, that's Steffi's rolling studio. Oh, I like yours all tattered like that. You like yeah. it? Yes. I like it like that. Me too. Here comes the layers. <laughs> yeah, I have shredded material over the place now. Oh, close the rotary. Okay, the there you go, Judy. <laughs> Yeah, those things are dangerous. I have one too, and it's pretty wicked. Look at mine. Mine's purple. But this is a wicked little tool right here. I went and slid and just barely tapped my finger, and it slices it right open. Yeah. Sharp little sucker. Here, we'll put it right over there, Judy. <laughs> Gosh, if Judy, if you ever watch Stephanie, some of Stephanie's past videos, she gets out hacksaws and stuff. So. Yep. <laughs> Oh my God, when she got out that blade. Oh my during gosh. The one, and she's trying to cut those lights. I'm like, oh my God, put the knife down. Put the knife down. <laughs> she got out that big hacksaw. Oh my God. Oh, 
Oh gosh. Judy says she got sliced in my class from a lady next to her. Oh. Ouch. What? On a rotary cutter, I believe. In a in like a crafting class? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my word. That's horrible. I was closer to my edges. Oh, <laughs> Listen to us. <laughs> Just rip it away. Average, average, average. And it is boring outside here. I think I'd take that over the weather we're having. The windy weather? Friggin' freezing cold stuff. Freezing cold? Yeah. We had snow for two days. It snowed two. for two days. Yeah, we get we get crazy weather. Well, you know that. Yeah. Montana. Yeah, that's why I drove back home. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, no. <laughs> <laughs> Net happening. I'm like, I thought Chicago was bad, but at least when it's warm, it's warm. <laughs> and when it's cold, it's cold. Yeah, it gets cold there, doesn't it? What was yeah. it? Negative it was something? Like something? Below. Yeah. It's below zero. It's below, yeah. below, like 20 and 30 below. Yeah, that's what happens here, too. That's crazy, guys. Like, we just had yeah. snow for two days, and it's freezing. But then, again, Monday, now it's supposed to be 50 again. It just, we're having a crazy winter this year. <laughs> I just don't get it. Yeah, it's, it's, it gets crazy here, too. Everyone's like, so all right, get done gluing time. and start doing something, would ya? Are you gluing still? Yes. Oh, I'm gluing my inside, my inside fabric, not one of these, but a different fabric that I'm putting on the inside for oh, my gotcha. for now. So, yeah, I'm working on the, um, the outside, I guess. And of course I use a fabric that's not going to shred at all or just, or anything. <laughs> what do you use? I don't, I don't use my brain half the time, but. I'm going to see. Maybe it will. <laughs> you said you don't use your brain. Yeah, I don't use my brain half the time. I, I get going before I fully think about what I'm doing. Oh, you brain train. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, yeah. It'll shred nice. I'll pull some of that. Not really. It just kind of pulls. It doesn't really shred. Yeah, it likes, I like to snag it. Yeah, this one doesn't really shred. It just kind of pulls away. So that's not going to work. So I'll just have to cut it to the edge like I was originally doing. Oh, I'll have to think of something else. <laughs> Sarah, you want to click on you so we can see what you're doing? Well, I we just we just clicked to you, honey. We were on. Um, oh, they're watching me cut yeah. now, because that's exciting. Well, that's what I'm doing too. I'm shredding pieces of. Fabric. Yeah, this is this is kind of what it's like, guys. When you're starting a project you haven't done and you're starting from scratch, you kind of got to go with go, go with, with how it's flow. going. Go with the flow. I've had a crazy week. I haven't had much time to myself at all. Monday, I bowled. Tuesday, my daughter had a game. Today, she had practice. Tomorrow, she's got a game. Then we go right from her game right to her chorus concert. Wow. So, her daughter is but, a busy, busy bee. But this weekend, she doesn't have anything. Thank the Lord. So guess what I'll be doing all weekend? <laughs> Catching up? <laughs> crafting. Yep. Just crafting. Crafting, crafting, crafting. Because I got lots of stuff I got to work on. Yeah, I do too. Let's see if I can get 
this one going this way. Oh, you're welcome, Steph. Just trying to look at the chat so we don't miss anybody. Oh, yeah. questions. oh, hi, Dollar Queen. Oh. Hi, Dollar Queen, Lee. And just again, so you guys know what we're doing, we can go over that again. Um, me, Laurel, and Angie are working on a flip book or flip box. Flip, uh, flip box. Yeah, flip box kit. The flip box <laughs> kit from Rosie Posey. And she has two left available guys look how gorgeous this fabric is i swear i would have just bought this kit just for this beautiful rose fabric yeah i love the rose fabric yeah it's like so shabby chic and it, it just is like so amazing tattered up like that i'm almost going for like a quilted look but i'm doing mine completely different from <laughs> Else. I have no idea what kind of look I'm going for right now. I'm just gluing down fabric. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm just uh, not doing it the way I'm supposed to, but hey, I like it. I'm just kind of putting fabric down here and there and having a good old time. That's what it's all about. Right? That's right. Yeah. I know, isn't this exciting, guys, to watch me cut fabric? It's got to be oh, super yeah. duper exciting. Hey, you, know, it, you maybe have somebody may not know how to cut fabric. Yeah, <laughs> and the technique that you use, Laurel, it's it's isn't it's it? Unbelievable. I just can't even. What I will know. tell anybody that does not know, this is my fabric, and only fabric scissors they oh, don't yeah. touch anything else except fabric <laughs> yeah i don't have any of those kind of scissors yeah that's the same here i have mine uh mine mine cut everything from metal to fabric to glue to oh, thank you. paper to everything in between <laughs> yeah i have every kind of scissors any kind of shredding yeah apparatus <laughs> distressor and did you get your uh see i don't know if that should be open like that that kind of bothers me did you get your thing done for your snippet roll uh no not yet because jeff isn't here he'll have to build me that but i did get my snippet i added a few more things to it <laughs> <Just> yeah <laughs> i sat and added a few to my and then i'm like okay that's enough yep gotta stop now <clears throat> Imagine. But I will. I'm going to definitely do a frame around it because I think it'll be perfect. Okay. All right. It's a little bit crooked to me. I don't know why. It's going to bug me. I don't like things looking crooked. No, we don't like that. It makes me crazy. Everyone's probably like, God, I would have had that box done by now. <laughs> <laughs> no. <sighs> They're all you're such There's a nothing quick about, about negative a new project. Here. <laughs> What'd you say, Laurel? There's nothing what? But there's nothing quick about a new project. No. At all. Nothing. So I'm just stressing the edges. I should have done that. I'll go ahead and click on me. I should have done that before I even started gluing stuff down, but. I hey, thought about doing Oh, this. I didn't even think about that. I, that's what I got to do. So I'm just de-stressing my edges of my box. So, Sarah, did you glue on the inside in between the folds, like that quarter inch piece? Did you put glue there or no? Yeah. See, I didn't. But only, I thought that but only a little right. bit. Only like a little right bit. Like, 
I might have to put some just on the corners to hold that down. Yeah, I only did a little tiny bit. She said just to don't glue. The only place to not glue right. is on the score uh, edges. Scored edges. Right. We don't want to mess it up. We don't want to make Rose mad. She's like, now listen up, ladies. And listen good. And listen good. That's how my grandma, that's how my grandma, she's fine. She's like, listen up and listen good. <laughs> so again, I'm just, oh, I didn't click off of you yet. Okay. Okay. So I am just distressing this with my all purpose scissors. I don't have fabric scissors and paper scissors i just have all-purpose scissors and then they get ruined all the time and i buy new scissors that's why you keep a pair just for fabric i know i just spit when i was going oops okay all right so now my edges are all distressed ah that's hot why do I got my glue gun on? Yeah, glue gonna, usually is hot. I'm gonna take my famous inky dink. I'm gonna go ahead and stress my edges. I'm trying not to get it's not working, but I'm gonna use Victorian velvet. getting ink on the fabric that's why i should have done all this before i glued it down but hey you know what the best thing about watching other people doing crafting is if they do make mistakes you get to learn from them that's right so it's never a bad thing to make mistakes while you're crafting live because people get to learn from your mistakes and that's always a good thing. Yeah, because I make them all the time. <laughs> hey, nothing's wrong with that. That means that you're a good crafter. You make I remember stuff. one of my first videos. I open my fabric tech because sometimes I open it to get the excess that's coming out. And mm -hmm. I forgot to close it. Oh, no. and I went to squeeze. I squeezed and it just came out. All, I was like, oh my God, this is yeah, not you it. were on with me when that happened. <laughs> I'm like, this is not happening to me. It's like, hey, all right, what? that's yeah, that. Going. Now I can work with all my other stuff. Let's see. Okay, so let's go back to Laurel then since she's in third deck. Right? Oh, I'm not doing anything yet. I'm just thinking. Okay. I'm thinking out loud. Just takes a little time to think. And I'm just distressing my edges melodramatically. Because I'm trying to decide. I want to put some pockets and stuff here, but I want to do some layering first. So I think I want this right here. Here, like that. So we're going to glue that down and then we'll cut it out. Because to me, I find it's easier if I glue it. And then cut rather than trying to cut and then go, wait, I want my pocket to go this way. So I want this to show more. So I was right. I do want it over here. I'm already like decorating the outside. I'm doing, I'm doing a Lorelli. Yeah. You're doing it from, oh, from top cool. to bottom instead of bottom to top. Yeah. I love decorating on the outside. Like when I do a gift or something, it's like my favorite thing is, um, Decorating the outside. We're on you now, Angie, just so you know. Oh, okay. But you're actually doing something. So all I'm right. doing is just... You're actually doing something interesting. <laughs> you're actually know. doing something interesting. <laughs> I'm very interesting. Interesting gal, ladies. 
Right now I'm just using the hearts. I'm kind of building the outside right now. Yeah, that is kind of surprising. I'm surprised you're doing the outside. Are you creating? I know. Well, it just is kind of flowing. So yeah. I figured I better go with it, right? Yep, that's yeah. right. You got to go with what's working. Whatever works best for you. Because I've never done this kind of crafting before where it's like right now. Don't think, just go. <laughs> yes. Let's go. I hear you. I know. We're all, I mean, we're all getting used to it. We're not. You've only been on coming on for a little while, so we're right here yet. You haven't even been crafting live and doing this kind of stuff for a year yet, so no, nope. all on the fly right now. Mm -hmm. Again, ladies, this this craft. If you want to see the whole kit, go, go head on over to Laurel's channel. Well, if you can write in there whenever you get oh, a chance to the chat. Yes, I will. So you guys can click on the three little dots next to Laurel's channel. And make sure you subscribe and you can um, go on over to her channel and see the whole video showing the whole kit. And then this kit is $25, including shipping, which is awesome. So if you're interested, and um, there's only two kits left, so you better get them while they're still in there. I'm just inking my edges on some of these hearts right now. With whatever I can find. <laughs> I'm doing some distressing. Yeah, me too. I'm distressing my box edges that is done so you got my box edges distressed nice and yummy and now i can put on my little patches this one's i know what the number here this one's two we're missing somebody tonight who is that Do you want me to just write the name of my channel or share the link to my channel? Either or. Oh, hi. Um, what am I listening? Oh, Judy's live. My question was for you ladies in the chat. Oh, okay. Where's Brandy? Oh, okay. That's why I said it's missing. Don't make me mad. <laughs> Laurel Victorian right. velvet let's, is a beautiful color. Let's see if and this uh, I just doesn't work. Come back to it another day when you clear head. Although you showed the kit at the beginning, but yeah. if you guys want to go check out the whole kit, I also did a video on the kit. I don't know if that link works. If it does, let me know. If it doesn't. Well, Victorian, yeah, I love Victorian velvet rose, and I only have that little bitty one. One of these days, I'm going to have to get the big one. Victorian rose velvet. Oh, I think that that's a, a color. A what do you do with a project you cannot get right, and you walk away a bunch, and you still can't get it right? Um, Anastasia, my crazy. projects usually take me, I just... What I've learned is you have to get past the ugly, as they call it sometimes. Um, you just, I always seem to just go back and add more. Um, and th different things will come to me each time I go back and pull it out again. And, but sometimes it takes me a while with projects too. It just, or sometimes I take it, a lot of it apart and redo it. And then that works too. Yeah. I tend to leave it, you know, for the moment. Yeah, you just you just have to keep going, Anastasia, and just keep adding more. What what is it you're working on? Maybe we can help. Post it in one of the groups. I'm sure someone can help. We all have uh, we all brainstorm together, so we can usually come up with something. 
I think she was just trying to convo. Feel the silence. <laughs> uh, I think she was just trying to fill the silence. No, she's actually stuck on oh. something she's working on. Oh. I love this rose paper, Miss Rosie Posey. Paper? I mean, uh, fabric. Like what paper? <laughs> I didn't get any rose paper. You know what, Laurel? I've had enough of your... Well, I was going to be like, wait a minute. I didn't get any rose paper. <laughs> you little snack. Yeah, rose paper. Let's see here. There's rose paper? Three. Yeah, exactly. No, no rose paper. I messed up. I'm sorry. Forgive me. Oh, that one's going to look cool right there in the middle. <laughs> I'm just tattering and making kind of like a... I love cheesecloth. I like to... Um, oh, I love cheesecloth. Tatter it. I always use it as some form of a layer. Yeah. I hear you. And I'll just pull it and keep it in a circle. That's how I do it when I put them on my flowers. I kind of just um, stretch it out a little bit. Right. I pulled a crafty no no, my hot glue gun was turned off. <laughs> uh oh. Oh no, no. I know. Hurry, heat up. I love all these tiny bits though. Oh my gosh. They're just Yeah, I love the little flowers, the little teeny tiny flowers. And those little silver ones. They're so cool. Yeah. That look like they have a little stone in the center. Yes. Rosie, you're going to have to share with me where you get all your little bitty things. She gets them all in California. So. Okay, well, I'm I coming to California. Yeah, exactly. I'm going back, back to California. I used to live in California, so I'm coming down. <laughs> She's going, going so, back. I meant to ask you the last time, why did you leave California and go to Montana? <laughs> well, I was born and raised in Montana. Oh, okay. So we left Montana. Um, California. Yeah, because my husband, he's an engineer, and his work brought us to California. Right. I lived in Bakersfield. Oh, okay. And uh, so, yeah. And then we were there for six years, and then we came back um, in 2006. So we've been here ever since. But yeah, I'm a mountain girl. A I mean, time. I like California and I like the oceans and stuff, but. I don't never want to live on an ocean, personally. Yeah. You never want to live what? I, mean, I wouldn't, I don't mind going to the ocean every once in a while, but I never would want to live on one. Live like right off of an ocean. Yeah, yeah I mean, we were a couple hours from the ocean. Yeah, or I'm like three hours two, three hours from the ocean. After the recent hurricanes, uh, yeah, it's given me a whole new outlook on being close to, although I've never wanted to be close to water just because of that. I don't want to live on fault lines either, but I have to. Oh, well, there's a major fault line that runs right through Illinois. Oh, really? You guys A big nice. one. Yeah. Mm. But I try not to think about that. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, I hear well, you. Well, I, I live I live next to Yellowstone, so Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's <laughs> kind of scary. I think I wouldn't like that very much living right next to that huge ass volcano that could go off at any time. So they say, I don't know. You don't worry about it too much, I guess, cuz you worry about it when it happens, right, Angie? Right. Yeah. I mean, we had a, you know, we get earthquakes up here. We had when oh, she wants to know what brand of scissors you ladies use? I use, these are Fiskars, titanium scissors. I actually got them at um, 
at Joanne Fabrics. They had a three pack of them on sale. So I got this one, yeah. this one, and this one. And I think I paid $7.99 for them. They were on sale. Um, and they're all titanium yeah. and they're all, and you can hear. Yeah. I don't know if you can hear that, but this is a good, they are nice and tight together. That's why these are great fabric scissors. But all of them work really well. All, mm. uh, and I use these for paper. And then I use these for whatever, but they're all really good scissors. So yeah, I got them at Joann's. Rose loves what you're doing, Ange. Okay, what am I doing? No, she loves what you're doing. Oh, thank you, Rose. I'm just waiting for my glue gun. I'm so sorry. There you I go, always... Anastasia. Take it apart and add more. <laughs> I always um, have my glue gun on, and today is like, he's not cooperating. She is not cooperating. I don't know where she is, Miss Rosie. Who? Randy? Me neither. I've tried messaging her. Either she got really sick again or she's MIA. I mean, and also it says she hasn't been on Facebook for like 11 hours. So I don't know. Oh, poor thing. She's been really sick. They say the flu's going around. Um, yeah, my mom and my grandpa. Come on. It's going everywhere. That's the thing. It just is going everywhere. Yeah, it is. I mean, I had it really bad and um, during Christmas. Oh, yeah. Oof. Okay. Come on. There we go. There we go. Also, I have the um, one of my favorite scissors when you're asked about scissors is uh, Tim Holtz scissors. Yeah, she was asking all of us what scissors we use. Yeah, I have the, this is by Tonic, well, Tim Holtz, but he just came out with a whole new line of scissors. Do you know what I heard? Is that what? they're all the same, he just changed yes. the color. Yep, and that is true. So, I have all his scissors, and then I have, um, these are a lot of fun if you guys, um, these are, uh, Kind of like they they're shredded shredded they shred paper or you can make like grass with them these are really oh, cool. yeah That's my cool. mom has some of those for for herbs yes i love these scissors so these are martha stewart i think these are discontinued but i know stamping up still yeah, has I these can buy them. Them. you can right buy there. them at, in the kitchen you can buy them in the kitchen area oh there you go i want a pair of those yeah, and they're really sharp too. I mean, they shred really they're well. For, I, yeah, they're actually for cutting um, food. They're yeah. And well, I mean, well, these ones I got in the it. craft section at Michaels. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh well, yeah, my mom has them. Like, they're for like they're making for fringe on the end yes. of paper and stuff. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Well, oh, well, yeah. I don't know. What I also I do with them is like I take old book paper. And I'll cut the book paper and shred the book paper. I mean, you can run it through a shredder, but I just use these. And then I crunch it up and I use it for um, packing. So, and then I have Chinese scissors. I don't know if you've ever seen these. <laughs> got, Chinese scissors. But we're talking about crazy scissors. <laughs> I do. I have Chinese scissors. scissors. What is Chinese scissors? <laughs> um, they're just, they're from China. And I think they're, oh. <laughs> They do a lot of, I don't know, they call them Chinese scissors. That's what they call them. Oh, I'm like, they're from China. So I call well, they're from China too, but I don't know. They just say they're really good cutting leather and stuff, and they are good. Oh, at leather? Okay. They're like more like a textile scissors, but they're called Chinese scissors. I don't know. Oh, oh okay. I thought you were just talking <laughs> this. Is there I, did, I did call them that. <laughs> she named them Chinese scissors. Uh, nope, not me. <laughs> Everyone say hi to Maggie. Oh, is Maggie oh, here? Maggie. Yes. Hi, Maggie. Sorry, I got out of the chat. It's okay. That's why I was just checking chat just to see what was going on. Okay. So I'm just making a flower right now. I'm going to... Got my hot glue gun going. Mm. 
Maggie, don't don't you live in California? Or no, she doesn't live in California, does she? I need to learn how to cut a straight line here. <laughs> <laughs> My line's not very straight. Oh, well, we all learn at our own pace, honey. Really, really. Really, really, really. My sisters used to go really belly, rubber jelly belly. Oh, really? So I'm not the only one who called you that? Not smelly belly. They called me really belly, rubber jelly belly. You call me smelly belly. There's a difference. <laughs> And the funny thing is, though, is that you answer to it. <laughs> you like. <laughs> That's the funny part. It is funny. I would, if someone called me that, I'd be like. Eh, eh. <laughs> My daughter, um, her name's Ellie. So that's why I'm like. <laughs> I mean, my daughter, it's like Ellie, Belly, Bell. Um, what else do I call her? Well, I call I Cam. I call Cam Hammy Cam. Um, Hammy Cammy. But yeah, I call her Belle or Ellie Belly. Or L. Call her L a lot. My dad used to call her um like you know, E Z, like easy. Yeah. Tell is like, Dad, I don't like that nickname. Oh, I love how this is looking. Shoot, my husband's called me like three times now. I'm going to have to. Who do you want me to put it on? Laurel, do you want me to put it on you? I gotta take a break. It's on Ange, isn't it? Yeah, is that okay? Yeah, she's making a flower. I'm still cutting material. Okay, I'm going to have to go use my daughter's phone to call my husband. Okay. okay all right, bye. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I'm just layering up layers inside mine. Such cute little trinkets in here. Okay. Mm -hmm. I think. But I keep telling myself, think, 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 think. What are you doing? Oh, I'm getting some muslin now. I'm gonna think I'm I'm really loving the outside, so is... sorry if that was loud. It's not. Sorry. I'm guessing it's nothing compared to my whistling. <laughs> You whistle? No. <laughs> I don't know what the issue is that I feel the need to whistle when I'm on with Sierra all the time. It's good to whistle while you work. Right. I was just going to say, whistle while you work. <laughs> <laughs> is it like the dwarfs? Seven dwarfs, yeah. I'm making, I'm trying to make um, some leaves. Aw. See how that'll look too. Mm -hmm. Kind of left pieces hanging. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Rose. And like I said, I I shred everything. And all I did was I folded this in half and then kind of cut out a leaf, and then I'll just off center them and put it in there. Mm -hmm. This is the piece I want to work with right here. 
And this is just um, coffee dyed muslin. I I buy the um, well, I buy the bleached and unbleached muslin. Let's see. Let's see if this would work. It's gonna fall apart on me. <clears throat> Where's my fussy cut scissors? Give me my fussy cut scissors. Yeah, right? Oh, God. So. Okay, it's a little quiet up in the house. It's quiet. We are. Not me. We're not as chatty as we normally are. It's because we're concentrating on something I've never seen before. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's what it is. It's like, oh, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I mean, I've got the plan going. At least the outside is super cute. Let's take might be too big for that. I need a little dangle or something. Let's see, what can I do out of here? Um. Mm. All right, so this is working out pretty good. So let's just make it a big cut and then go from there. Might have to. I love adding dangles, obviously. Oh, I think it was. I want this on the front somewhere. I really like that. So we're going to finish fussy cutting it out and see how it turns out. Rose is probably like, what are you doing? No, Rose is loving it, right, Rose? You love that I'm shredding up all your fabrics. <laughs> Where's a little... Uh, Looking for a little steam in. I actually just love all this little tiny stuff there. Oh, there it is. Of course you do. Mm -hmm. That's what sold me, Rose, was that little, these little tiny trinket pile over here. One of it, anyways. It's so pretty. I know Edna got should have got hers too. I wonder if she doesn't know we're on. She should, although I don't know if she follows Sierra, so Oh yeah. She might not. Hmm. <clears throat> although we I know she's she's got to because she says she puts all our videos in a playlist. So Yeah. Maybe she's just got something going on. Because I know she was getting the kit. All right, doesn't quite look the same, but it will when I get something going around it. Where's my heart? Give me my hearts. Why this one? This one. And then this is going so, what do you guys think? Just leave it like this, and maybe have some dangles on there for the front of it, guys. It doesn't quite look like a flower, though, does it? No, not really. And I'm going to have a tie on mine that closes it shut. I think I'm going to go with this. I need some flowers around mine. All right, here we go. Gluing down time. Right, so I think it's time to pull out the uh, die cut machine. I need some flowers. I love that I now know that I can cut fabric with my uh, dies. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's awesome. I, yeah, see, I didn't know you didn't know that. <laughs> now you're going to be cutting up everything. Well, you know, if I would have read the book when I bought the machine, I might know that. But, you know, it, it was it, time for that. I was just excited to have a die cut machine. So, I just sure. Eyes. 
I can't find it at the moment. So I'm just going to glue these little, so it's like very tattered little leaves on here. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you, Maggie. Thank you, everybody. Okay, my medium one is missing. Of course, why is it the one I'm looking for is the one that's missing? I'm telling you, Sarah, this, is, this is my life. <laughs> Oh, I hear you. Life. This is very like unusual for me. I don't craft on the fly, but it's a it's a fun challenge for uh, sure. You seem to do really well crafting on the fly. <laughs> I don't know. I'm done. There we go. End of the show. <laughs> Just kidding. And then I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna glue the back here, guys. So I think that's what I'm gonna do back here. And I actually might put some lace behind here. I didn't think about the that pretty your heart? I know you were working on your heart before. Where'd you put it? Right here. Right here. Oh, there it is, up in the corner. Mm -hmm. Aww. Fake leaves. So yeah, that's that's eye appealing. And I probably put some dangles. I think I might put a tag. I don't know, our tag back here. Aww. Yeah. So we'll just love it. Through. Rose, there might not be enough stuff for me to put inside the box. <laughs> it might be all going on the outside. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens to me sometimes is I get going and then I don't have enough of anything left. Let's see if well, I I'm like Laurel. I, I'll use it up to... Exactly. Every bit of it. Every little bit. Because more is more. For sure. Okay. <clears throat> so we can switch to Laurel. Okay. Really? Do we have to? Why? What's wrong with what you're doing? Laurel is the slowest crafter on the face of this earth, and I'm not that exciting to watch at the moment. All right, not cutting that fabric. Uh oh. Okay, so I just glued mine down here, just in the back. You don't want to glue the sides because then you'll glue it shut. So, just enough to clip, make it a, a closure on it. Well, I check out that tag. Okay, so it does not cut all material in case anything. It doesn't? No. No. What did you try to cut with it? That that other material that came in the kit. And it's not, it doesn't seem oh, to want to cut. Oh, the, the rayon, the sheer one? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, that won't, that probably won't cut. I don't want to cut that. But I want it to. <laughs> Big nabbit. Not being my friend. No. She doesn't want to do it. All right, we'll just have to cut that out. We're not on me, are we? Because yep, nothing's we moving. I'm not sitting. With my hands over my thing, so switch to somebody else, please. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, okay, so I am making a pin. I actually have decided that I want to make mine a little mm -hmm. sewing kit. 
So Ooh. I am making a pin cushion for the middle of it. So that's what I'm doing. And I'm just kind of drawing a circle around my material so I can make kind of like a, it's almost like a poofy flower looking thing. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. But a poofy flower looking thing. Yeah. I you love know, your like description of stuff. <laughs> yeah. That's what it is. It's a poofy looking flower. It's a pin cushion for the middle pretty much. I'm going to make it out of my muslin material because I want to make it out of the rose material, but I don't have enough of it. So I'm going to just use the rose material to um, yeah, that's going to work. Okay. So I'm going to use the rose material. Oopsie daisy. What's going on here? Nice All right, let's try. Needle and thread. Don't tangle up on me, girl. But I thought this would be a super sweet little sewing kit because... Yeah, that's a great idea. I'll show you what I'm doing, but I'm going to put little, like... Dang it. Nice. This thread, I'm not going to be able to use that one. Rose tells me to move on. She's like, now the inside. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Rose. I'm going Rose in. Rose is the boss here. Rose is the boss. We can't forget that. Okay. Going in, Rose. So, um, to make the little pin cushion, I'm going to sew around the... I cut out a big circle about there's eh, there's my thing it is about six and a half inches wide now i'm sewing the whole edge around it i'm just doing as easy slip stitch or not slip stitch running stitch you running stitch oh stupid glue stinking glue yeah the stinking glue if you forget to put your cap on it I forget on that. Stop it. <laughs> it. Don't laugh, Laurel. No laughing. <laughs> Don't regroup here. I leave mine open constantly. That's why I'm laughing. If you forget, it's gone. <laughs> I know, and it's so hard to... Uh, um, yeah, you can't save it. There's no saving it either. Yeah, it's so hard to get out of the bottle too. Like all right. It's hard. Okay. So I hope you ladies are here for the long haul because <laughs> <laughs> yeah. This is definitely not a five-minute project, that's for sure. Yeah. It's going to be a couple hours. Actually, I should have put this on the back of this one. Oh, I can do that right here, maybe. Okay. It's thunder and lightning outside. I don't know what the deal is. We had really strong wind the other day. Um, it was yesterday, the night before. Oh my gosh, another phone call. I thought I turned that off. Sorry about that, Jenna. I'm live. <laughs> I 
it's all right. <laughs> She's like all what? shocked on her face. <laughs> what? Oh, Jenna walked in. She forgot that I was live. And I'm like, Jenna, I'm live. And she's like, she had a death look on her face. <laughs> um, Rose says that we are too quiet. No, we're not, Rose. We're, we're concentrating. You are too Jeez, quiet. Rose, you're really, uh... <laughs> you should come on here and you can fill the silence, honey. <laughs> Let's see. He's like, no, I think I'll pass. Yeah. Okay, so I gotta get some stuffing. Okay, so then what I'm gonna do now, no. people, ladies and gents, is I'm gonna stick this little cardboard um, circle that I cut in the middle. Because I want it flat on the bottom and Kind of again, where did my stuffing go that I brought on here? Okay. Oh, Let's take some of this one. Okay. Oops. Here we go. So now I'm just going to stick some stuffing in here. Yeah, that's a great idea. For the middle. Look at you go. Who? Sierra. I know. Look at her. She's like Speedy Gonzalez over here. What are you talking about? I I haven't look. I haven't even started the other edges or anything yet. I'm just doing the pin cushion. Okay. Okay. So. So now that I got that all done and in, in there, I gotta pull this really tight so all the edges are really, really tight. And then I gotta stick my needle through here. I can sew this sucker closed. Oops, I need to bring the needle back through this hole. Sully. Sorry about that, guys. What's his name? At least your phone's not ringing every five seconds. <laughs> Solomon. <laughs> Sullivan? Solomon. Solomon? Oh, Solomon. Oh, Sully, yeah. like on the monster. Yeah, we call him Sully. Oh, I love that. That is so... Yeah, he's a little French dog, and he thinks he sees things. Maybe he sees ghosts. I don't know what he sees, but he just needs to knock it off. <laughs> <laughs> just like really, there's nothing there. Just get over here. You get over it. He sees dead people. Maybe. <laughs> I knew she was going to say that. Well, I think I everybody did because... Um... It's me. <laughs> as long as it isn't me. Goes first. Oh gosh, I'm gonna have to go spank him. Hold on. Not for spank. Oh no, he just gone. Okay. All right. Got maybe that. I should use the sturdier piece of cardstock and maybe less cotton. I don't know. I'll glue the sucker down. Okay. Okay, okay. So I'm just sewing the top shut. And I am using upholstery thread, which seems to work like a charm on this sort of stuff. You know. Okay. So I'm just going to tie it off with this slip knot. Okay. Or whatever you call this stitch. Oops. See. I'm getting stuck on my camera poles. Okay. So now that's done. And now that's all sewn up. So I'm going to now 
decorate this little man here. And I'm going to, I believe, put a little rolled rose coming out of this material on top. Take my, my there we go. All right, I really tattered up that heart. <laughs> What'd you do? <laughs> I really tattered up that heart. She tattered her up. She tattered, tattered her, her up. up. There, I uh, there, perfect. Thank goodness. All right. See, I'm glad we wrote the numbers down because I'd been messed up already. Well, my numbers are gone. Yeah, my numbers are gone now. I covered my numbers. I can't even oh. see my numbers, so it really doesn't matter. But I can tell because the longer. Yeah. Fine. <clears throat> I'll leave the magic loop on. I guess I should show you what I'm doing. So I'm making a rolled rose. Oh. It is. Oh. With this beautiful fabric. And this kit that is just magical. It is. It's really pretty. It's completely magical. I love this fabric. Absolutely. Completely adore it. Well, that's cute. I love your little pink cushion. Oh, thank you. Oh. Thank you, dear. I don't, I dear, I feel. Oh, geez. Here she goes with the singing. The tropical sun. Yeah, Maggie really puts out the projects really quick, too. I can't even keep up with anybody lately. <laughs> yeah, Maze or Maggie is really fast at. Yep. She says she's losing right now. Well, she's losing. She's like getting her projects done. Oh really? No way. No way. That's not possible for the for the. Um, That's what I say. No way. The great Maggie White. I don't believe it. If I could craft for more than, you know, one night, I'd be good. <laughs> you know, this working really hinders my uh, crafting Dang work. Dang work. Hindrance. Is there a lot of sick kids around still oh around? God, all it is is sick kids. Oh. Every day. We're sending two or three home. It's like, come on already. Oh, yeah. really? You send them home? That's ridiculous. I can't believe a parent. I mean, I can see like if your kid gets sick at we school. We have to. But if, they, if they throw well, up. Well, no, that's what I'm saying. But I can't believe parents like they or kids are that sick. And how do they not realize? Oh, that? you know that's what they'll say? Oh, I took their fever, their temperature at home, but I didn't get nothing. Sure you did. What they do is they <laughs> don't, they don't want to deal with it. <laughs> Right, they dope them up with uh, Benadryl and stuff and then bring them in and like two hours later, you know, the Benadryl's wearing off and here comes the raging, you know, fever. and Because you can only send them home if they got a fever, huh? You can't. Or if they throw up stuff. or if they have diarrhea. Oh. Yep. Nice conversation we're having here. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Let's talk about sounds something. Like the, it sounds like the Pepsi Complete commercial. <laughs> Upset stomach. How does that go? Nausea. Wait. Nausea, heartburn, Nausea, upset heartburn, stomach. Upset stomach uh, hold on. It's nausea, heartburn, upset stomach. Constipation, <laughs> diarrhea. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Can you have both of those? <laughs> oh, my God. Nausea, Nausea heartburn, heartburn, indigestion, <laughs> upset stomach, diarrhea. Nausea, yes. heartburn, indigestion, upset stomach. Okay, let's pick something else to talk about. <laughs> Hi, Jada. Oh. Hi, oh Jada. God. 
She's like, what did I just walk into? She exactly. <laughs> Like a, what are they talking about? Out, hot, hot, hot. I don't know why I'm getting so many calls right now. I have no idea. Yeah, I know. Really? Can you tell people you're busy? I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know. That's I don't know why is everyone like, no one calls me ever. And then all of a sudden, everybody's like, hmm, let's and notice since we've come, she, gotten back on, my internet has not gone out once. Yeah. <laughs> Stupid <laughs> thing. Well, that's like my dog. That happens. <laughs> I told my kids, I was like, I'm going to be busy. I told what I was doing and she forgot. She's like, I wish I could, you guys could have seen the face, look on her face. <laughs> what? When Jenna came in here, when I, I like how you were saying everybody's bugging you. And I, I try to tell everybody I was going to be busy and it doesn't work. Oh, yeah. Oh. I'm just everything into the floor. Oh, every time I come in here, you guys are talking about something odd. <laughs> yeah, see? Was that Jada? Did Jada say that? Yeah. <laughs> I know, Jada, we have issues. No, Sierra has issues. <laughs> no, 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 no. Let's not blame this on Sierra. <laughs> I'm innocent. Sierra is the perfect little princess. Yeah. <laughs> sure she is. Okay. So what else I got in my kitty kit kit? I can use some of these pieces. <laughs> Rosa, that's because they're odd. <laughs> yep, we are odd. odd. Um, I agree. Those, yeah, right, right. those two are odd. I'm just a special guest with your kit. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh, thanks, Angie. Thanks for <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. No, I don't believe you. I don't believe you. Kidding. Okay. That looks really cool. I've got some tattered, lots of tattered going on here. So one, two, three, four. Oh, that looks cool. So what? I know they probably want to see what you guys are doing. What are you doing, Laurel? Yeah, it's Laurel's turn. <laughs> it's not my turn. <laughs> She's like, it's get me out. Your turn. Gosh, Laurel. Let's see. You smelly little belly thing, you. Are you calling me smelly again? Yes, you stink. You stink. Oh, wow, this fabric curls when you slide your thumbs on it. I love this rose fabric. Me too. I'm, like, totally in love with it. And I got, I got some extra, too, because I got Happy Meal. You got some extra what? This rose fabric. How that? How did you get that? They got it for Happy Meal. Remember when oh, she well, sent me Happy Meal a while ago? She said we did roll. Oh, when Roll sent yeah. you the Happy Meal. Like good. That was like it was before this cave came out. So right. I'm looking at it. I bet Rose has all kinds of um, fabric that's rose. Because <laughs> Rose is on. Yeah. Because <laughs> Rose is rose. Mm -hmm. Oh, dang it. This stuff does not want to rip very well for me. Lorel's, or Lorel's coming out with something top secret over there. <laughs> She's hiding her stuff. I'm not hiding. I'm just trying to figure it out. You know me. It takes me forever. She's figuring it out. Guys. I'm a slow crafter, too. Still learning this, really. you know. It's still. I don't think you're slow, Angie. Angie girl. I don't know if I want to put this flower in the middle of this or not. So I'm really gonna have to shove it down if I do. It's not. It's not working out for me. I'm gonna pop to something to another place. Okay. 
So I'm going to go ahead and hop on over here. And I'm going to make me where my felt go. That rose. Yeah, that's okay. So here's my felt. I've gone from the outside to the inside to the outside. Because. <laughs> You know, I just don't know what I'm doing right now. I know, Maggie's probably like, yeah, let me help you frame that out. <laughs> She's so good at that stuff. I'm like, eh. I need help. Wait, what? Whoa, what? Oh, you know how they, they put all the, the trim and stuff around the pictures? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not, I'm more tattered than that. Flatten down, flower. Flatten down. <laughs> on there. Wow. Wow, you tell that flower, Laura. I'm <laughs> telling you. Doesn't want to go down. It's Where making her it mad. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. You tell him. All right. It just, all right, I guess it's down. It just doesn't, no, it's not. See, it's not staying. I don't understand anything. More shredding. I find this to be one of the best shredders, this uh, Prima. Foot <sighs> um, scrubber. Dresser. Yeah. Looks like a foot scrubber. Yeah, you know, have you ever used that? I thought about getting one of those. Try it. No, I haven't, but yeah, I thought about that too. I thought that that's what that thing looked like. So I was like, I'll just get a foot scrubber if I'm going to do it. Okay. Wow. Has anybody else used a foot scrubber? <laughs> Tried it? Because I used to use um, blocks of, before all this, these tools came out, I used to use um, sanding blocks. Oh, yeah. So. That's a good idea, too. Or an orbital sander sometimes I would use, you know, like a little tiny, like, uh, mouse, the uh, handheld ones. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I, have, I have one. Mm -hmm. Okay, you want to see my front so far? Yes. yes. Let's go. Let's, Let's see. Get off of Look at everybody. Yes. <laughs> it's not that much. Trust me. It's just the, the, just the one. Oh, that's part. cute. I made a little flower out I of a bunch that. of little pieces. Hold on. It's stuck. And what then bunch are you talking about? You see, I love that bunch. What bunch? I'm... What? That she said, it's here. I love that bun. And then she said, just kidding. I don't know what she <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> no, I'm not, Jada. Not me. And then I just put a button on there and stuck one of the images and a little piece of trim and some eyelash lace behind it. And then oh, yep, I love that. something. We're pink around. cording. So I have to figure out some kind of closure over here. But we'll work on, you know me, I work top to bottom. So we'll work on that later. Now I gotta figure out. I know I want pockets on the inside, so I yeah. took. I put down this uh, gray material. I think it was like a napkin or something, or beige material. And then I took little pieces of the stuff that came in it and some stuff that I had just mm -hmm. for layering. And I'm still gonna cover these, but I kind of left this one hang off on the top and the bottom too, because I like that. Because I can't do any shredding. So, and then in the center, I think I'm going to make mine. I'm going to put a charm in here. So, I might make pockets and put little things for charms or tag mm -hmm. charms or little embellishments and stuff. I'll That's make out of the tags and stuff for, that you can put, you know, on the charm. So, that's my oh, idea. That's a good idea. So, now I got to figure I want to use that pink that I cut and I want to use that to make some, some pockets. 
you know, I want to use that. Where'd it go? I want to use this to make some pockets going which way? This way? No, the other way. Oh, I like the lace on there. I know. I love the lace on here. But I want to use this and make a pocket and then maybe make a little higher one up here with something else because I don't think that's actually going to be deep enough. But we'll figure it out. And then maybe some lace on top of it just to, uh, you know, lace behind it to make it look. But, yeah, let's try that. So we need to cut this one right about here. So, yeah, you guys, again, um, just if anyone new to come in, we are working on Miss Rosie Posey's first ever kit and it's $25 including shipping killer deal and it, mm -hmm. she made this this is an original idea by Rose it's called a flip box wow. flip box it's between a flip book and a explosion box so it's a really cool original idea and we're all deciding what we're going to make out of ours I decided to make a little sewing kit out of mine, and Laurel looks like she's going to make a charm kit, and Angie, do you know what you're going to do yet? Are you still Um, It's like charm, collage, same thing. Collage with her stuff. Some collages in there, maybe. So Angie's going to collage Oh, little up. collages. That'll look cool, Angie. Yeah. I like that idea. Well, who knows? You could even make it like a little thing that holds embellishments or something. Yeah. All right, that didn't work very well. So we're just going to cut that. Actually, it can go crooked. It doesn't have to be straight at all. And then I want something. I need to put something else up behind there. So wait, let's. Oh, gosh. It's fiber tack. Crazy. All right, let's get this sucker glued down first. See, and I'm using other stuff too because I know how I am. And I tend to use up everything that comes in a kit. <laughs> so, <laughs> yes. I want to make sure I have room, I have enough stuff. So. Not that there's not a lot in this kit, but I tend to go overboard because my motto is more is more. So Right. And Angie is learning how easy that is to do like she mm. did on her snippet roll. Yeah. I was like, give it up already. Get her in. And I don't mind that this isn't even. I want it kind of, I I like that look. So we're just going to leave it where it kind of goes on an angle like that. Just cut off the edge that's hanging on. There's my good scissors right here. There we go. Oh. Just got glue on my good scissors. That's not good. Mm -mm. Oh, no, 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 girl. That's not good. All right, so that'll be a little pocket. Oh, well, it would have been a little pocket if I wouldn't have glued the whole thing down. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> All right, let's just pull that back up and try this again. Oops. Okay. Yep, whoopsie daisy. I needed to glue it to something else. That's what I was saying. I needed to glue it to something else. Oh my goodness. Hard. Because I want this Hard. part to show. I want it to be curled like that. Let's see if I can fix this. Come on. No. See, guys, you, you don't want to learn from me right now because Laurel tends to, you know. Oh, shush. Threw everything up all the time. 
It's very hard for me when I'm on here and I'm creating something I haven't created before and I'm trying to think on the fly here. Right? I'm thinking about flies and create. All right, so let's do this again. Let's put this on here. I'm just sitting here hand sewing like normal. I'm always hand sewing something in my projects, I swear. You guys are hand sewing. Okay. Now I need a hand sew. So for some reason. Hey, at least I'm getting good at using my sewing machine. Yep. That's a good thing. Are you new to the sewing machine, or are you are you are you really good at? I mean, um, I can pretty much figure out anything. I mean, I used to sew yeah. when I was when I was younger, and I took sewing in grade school and junior high or junior high. I mean, and I yeah, mean, I do know, I do know how to sew. Yeah. She's a pretty good sewer, if you ask me. I think so. Oh, thank you, Leaf. She says we're all doing excellent. Thank you. Thank you, Rose. You love it. Thank you, Rose. Right now, now let's do this the right way. Let's cut this out. Here we go. This makes more sense. Now, if you just did it right the first time, Laurel. I said it, but I didn't do it. Don't glue all the edges. Right. Well, no, I wanted to glue it down on something else first. <laughs> Gotcha. Okay. So I just made a little needle thing to put the needles in. Or two. Um, put needles in. All right, you can by all means switch to somebody else here because I keep backing away from my camera and all they're doing is staring at my desk. Okay, well, hold the phone. This is the bottom, so goes one, two. So this one's going to come up. So I actually want, yep, this one to go this way. And just I'm just like, making we're like, gonna that down. Little more pockets as well. Okay, so. So now we can glue around the edges of this. Okay. Then it'll be a nice deep pocket. There you go, Laurel. Put that Yay. thing cap on. There you go. Yay, Lorelei Bunny. There we go. No, it's a pocket. There we go. That's better. I like that color. Yeah. And then we can put some tags in there, some charms in there, and then we're going to move about the cabin. Move about the cabin. So I've got my trip all booked, guys. I'm getting excited. Where are you going? To Florida. Oh. Not to enjoy the weather. Aw. What are you going to do, Florida? And I hope my daughter has the baby the day after I arrive so that um, I have a whole two weeks with the baby. Oh. How many weeks is she now? Um, well, she's due March 8th, so oh, March 8th. Oh, okay. 32 now, somewhere around there, 32, 33. How is she like doing? That. Is it going good for her? Or? Yeah, she did. the beginning wasn't good, but it's going good now. Yeah. And then we can make this one like a tuck spot and tuck a card with some charms on it. Yeah, Laurel, that's the ticket. Mm-hmm. There's the ticket. Right, so this is goes this way. So we want it like this. Like it folding like that though. So let's I'll turn talk. It. Yeah, that would make a great tuck spot right there. Look at me. I'm turning it into a junk journal thingy. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Uh -oh I like this. 
applique, so it's got to go here. Got to go here, and then it can tuck down in there. There we go. Just got to turn it a little bit. All right, we need some more pretty, pretty stuff around it. Let's see. I don't know that I want to use on the back. Let's get this out. Let's see, what can I do with one of these? Hmm, maybe I can cut out some flowers. Think, Laurel, think. Think, girl, think. Think, think, think. So I don't want to cover all that up, but it needs some color in here. I definitely need some color in there. Something. Needs a little something, something. Give me my orange box of fun. Let's see what I can find here. So it needs some something, something there in a different color. We are quick on somebody else, right? Angela's here from Chronic Crafter. Hi, Angela. Hi, Angela. Hey, hey Christmas tree. Yes, Rose, I'll make sure the box closes. <laughs> it's like Laurel, a flip box journal. Exactly. <laughs> uh, I'll figure out something funky to make out of it. Mine's still good, Rose. We're still closing. Still close the shop. I really want this on here. I think we're going to do that. We're making flip boxes, uh, Angela. If you're wondering. Gosh, I just love all this tiny stuff. It's fun to work with, for sure. What was that fold? Nope, that's the wrong side. See? Wait, is that the wrong side? Nope, that's the right one. One, two, three, four. Yep, that's right. Is that my long edge? Oh no, there we go. All right, so it's closing, but it's hard to see where these bends are. Oh. Yep, it'll still close with it there. Yeah, mine's still. Yeah, mine will be okay. Um, put this puppy down. Not all the way, just around the edges. I feel like it's a chronic mess here on my desk. Sierra's awfully quiet over there. Who is? Sierra. Hello, no, Sierra. Sierra? Yeah. What? She's a concentrating. We're supposed to be talking. We're in a live I'm chat. I'm trying to remember which. Okay, that's the first one. Second one. Second, third, fourth. Okay. Down. Okay. okay. First, okay. So my first closure is gonna be the needle. So I'll go click on me. Maggie says, uh, frame the squares for baby photos, Laurel. Oh, that'd be a cute idea. Oh, that would be yeah, awesome. Be yeah. See. So, ladies, I went ahead and made this so little um, pockets on here, but I needle can do that holder, on the outside. Uh, because I'm making mine a little sewing kit. So, this is I put the felt in here and sewed this together. 
Uh-huh. It made it a little needle holder. Oh, cool. Gonna, I love that. Thank you. And I'm going to stick it down right here. And I'm thinking I'm going to put some of this piece of this lace on here or something. But I did make this really fat, so I'm really concerned. I'm losing my mind, guys. What? What happened? Having issues. Try to sew this through the bottom. So see, I did this one wrong too because it has to close here. So this should have been up a lot higher because you have to have it close. Yeah, I made my pin cushion too fat. So how I'm gonna fix that is I'm just gonna take my needle. Oops. Oh, look at that. I'm gonna sew mm -hmm. it through the bottom so it will go in the what I'm gonna do is go like this and then I go over to the other side come up on the other side and then I come through and pull this baby one thing I like about fabric tack what pull stuff back up for for a while <laughs> <laughs> too far down. I can't be where it's going to close. So that's got to go up higher. I so. like the colors that Rose put together for this too. Yeah, these colors are amazing, Rose. Truly, they are beautiful colors. Everything. Rose says you should do what Maggie suggested, Laurel. I know, that's what I'm thinking. Because my, my, what I'm thinking isn't working. The photos? Yeah. We'll do whatever you want. But, but that is cute. You know what I want to do. I'm just trying to figure out how to do it. So what I'm doing is I'm squishing my... My... Um, little pin holder. Or... My pin cushion down even farther by sewing through the bottom and coming up on the sides and just sewing it back down. If you knew what I mean. Okay. So now that I did that, now it's flatter and I'm going to glue this puppy down before I ruin anything else. <laughs> <laughs> Never. All right, I'll be back in one second, ladies. Okay, okie daisy. Okie dokie. Okay. Oakley dokely. Oakley dokely. Okay. So for this, I don't want all to match in here, so I want to get some. I want to. Put some little I want to put some little pieces sticking out around the edge so it doesn't okay. to look a little tattered. Adding these little bits That's cute. around the edges. Aww. I like that. Well, maybe. Oh, sorry. Thank you. Are you talking to me? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, okay. Hello, Laurel. 
Uh, or Lorel. Now I'm calling you Lorel. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't even know where I'm at either. No wonder I didn't know who you're talking to. <laughs> well, I was talking to you. But... <laughs> All right, I got it figured out. I just had to step away for a minute. Step rethink. away from the project. I had to rethink for a second think it and I think know. it out. Gosh, we are so on each other's brains, literally. We know each other like the back of our hands. It's about three and what is it? Three and a quarter. Look at that. You're good at that. I know what I'm going to do. If it works, we'll see if it works. It will work. You can do it. You can do it. I believe in you. I have my pencil with drawn this cardboard. All right. So three and a quarter. Three and a quarter wide by how long is this puppy? I believe in you. Three and three quarters. No, three and a quarter that way too, I'm guessing. Three and a quarter there. And we'll give it a little bit of space to bend. And then do three and a quarter there. All right. Let's cut this puppy out. <clears throat> Let's see if I can get this to work. Listen to all her measurements. Mm -hmm. Better work now. All right, guys, talk it up. We're supposed to be talk talking. We're not talking. Laurel, what are you trying to to do is good. You just need not glue on the folds. Yeah, I know. And I did glue on the folds because I'm a dork. Because, you know, I'm <laughs> jumping ahead of myself. Hey, I can call myself names. It's okay. You fine girl. Okay. She can call herself names, but she won't let me call her names. See how unfair right. that is? It's unfair. It's unjust. It's unjust, I tell you. Let's see if I can get this to work. So if I go here and this one opens. Yes. So we can stick this. I'm just going to cover up everything I just did. That's okay. Let's take that off. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops, it's easy. So let's put something on here and then I'm trying to think, trying to think. Think, Lorelli, think. See, I'm not good. I'm not good at this crafting on the fly. I, I, I really have to sit and. Oh yeah, I know. Think out my projects. This is so really <laughs> hard for me to do. You can do it, Laura. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe, I believe. You don't just have like four boxes. We got like five boxes. Right, exactly. No, <laughs> we've got one, two, three, four, five, ten boxes. Because there's another side. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. technically, yes. 
You want to be all technical about it. Oh, gosh. Let's see. Put this one here. And then this one opens. And so we need another one in there. So let's cut this in here. Get another one. My daughter, she gets hooked on a song. I don't know if you guys mm -hmm. can hear her music. Usually see her, I can. And she will just play it over and over and over. <laughs> and she's, uh, I don't know if you guys have ever seen uh, Burlesque. Um, no, I, I I think a long time ago, but I... Oh my God, it's like one of my most favorite movies. I don't know why, I just really, really love it. And that one song that she sings in, in there when she's wearing that green dress, I forget the name uh -huh. of it, but my daughter has been playing that for like over <laughs> two weeks now. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at that funny girl. She loves it, obviously. Well, she's in chorus and she's been singing since she was in uh, junior high. So she has a concert tomorrow. So to practice, she sings these kind of songs and stuff. Oh, uh huh. So she's always practicing with her voice. Have a good night, Anastasia. Good night. Hi, Anastasia. For joining us. We know we're like really slow poking it here. Yeah, sorry. It's taken five years. Again, everybody will have a finished project, and I'll have, like, my 10th unfinished project. <laughs> no. It's, it's just how it is with me. on yourself. Just can't finish, get anything just finished here. You just locked it, girlfriend. And then... There's this thing we have. I like these stamens too. These are neat ones. I like their mat. Their their mat. Finish on. I'm just really struggling over here. You got it. Unlike what to do next, Laurel? And what to do at all. I'm just struggling here. I believe in you. That's way too much white going on. Should have put that behind here. Maybe I just tuck it behind here. Way around. too much white going on. Well, we all know I've messed up when I'm resorted to the glue gun. <laughs> <laughs> You've resorted to the glue gun? Yep. Because I'm trying to hurry this puppy up. Well, not hurry it up, but you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, yeah, top, bottom. There's a lot, too. So I just want this to go over here. Mm -hmm. That to go right there. This. 
Ugh, it's glue. We're all having glue issues. Oh, it's this fabric tech. If you don't put the cap on, it's you're left with a big old bubble. Oh, I know. I'm going to glue these on the inside. There we go. Uh, they want to see yours, Lorel. No, they don't. Oh. Not yet, Leafa. <laughs> no, you don't. I've ripped it all apart, so no, you don't want to see it. Oh, you did, honey. Aww. I'll go to itty bitty. I am, I am struggling. I can tell you that. I don't know why. Sorry, guys. I know you guys. I, you guys. Thank you for reminding us to switch. I'm bad. That. We're all. So deep in concentration. <laughs> no, I've never been this deep before. Oh my goodness. But I'm getting it. Oh, getting there. What are these ladies doing? Yeah. We're doing Rose's kit. This was quite the challenge, Rose. I'm not the ch it's not the challenge. Yeah, I love the it's oh, so do I. It's a good thing, but it is because when it something challenges you, that's yeah, good. it's good for you when you're like I say, when you're comfortable, you're not challenging yourself. Yeah, but I do, I am like Lorel, though. It takes me, I ponder a lot and I and I think a lot. Yeah, I'm trying, unlike you know. Sierra, whose brain just instantly knows what to do. Oh no. Uh, oh yeah. <laughs> she acts like I'm a, a warlock or something. She's a lace lock, a lace warlock. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you guys are talking about. I have been even shown you my broom before. All right, I got one middle square done. <laughs> Yay. Look at little collages. Like little collages. Maybe. I don't know. Any minute, Rose oh, will be like, like sorry, right. we didn't I didn't click Angie, sorry. Oh, that's okay. Yes, Rose I just click on Angie and see okay. hers. Angie, do you want to show your sure. collage? Your so this is just the um obviously you guys saw let's see one, two, three. Let's see if this bad boy closes. Oh, good, it does. <laughs> Take a deep breath. <laughs> I'm scared. So it closes up like that. So this will be my front. And then still got a couple more. Top, things. bottom, right, left. There you go. Yep. And then there's just my center, just like a collage, the tag. So Open far. Up. Let me see the middle again. <clears throat> Looks great. No, open it up. Let me see the middle. It is open. No, I want to see that center square you did. Right here. Aww. Yeah. Look at that. And then this is a collage tag. Beautiful. That is so cool. Beautiful. But look at I still have one, two, three, four more squares. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Vonda. They're probably like, hurry it up, woman. Hurry it up. Try. We're moving, we're moving. Mm -hmm. I really like how mine's turning out. I like it. It's all tattered goodness here. Oh, yeah, mine's tattered like heck, yeah. Uh, yummy, tattered goodness. Mm -hmm. I love, I do love this trim though. It's pretty. I'm going to put some on there too. Bottom here. Okay. I need to figure out. 
They love your pin cushion little box. Thank you so much. If anybody needs a craft or a project that keeps them really concentrated, get Rose's kit now. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Order now. It will, it will keep you busy, that's for sure. Order now while supplies last. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. She's like, you guys are taking this way too seriously. <laughs> <laughs> It's like, I don't know what the deal is, but you guys are just making this right. way more complicated. I'll frame out one like Maggie said. Oh, thank you, Maggie, for coming. And thank, thank you, you, Maggie, for stopping by. Oh, good night. Good night. We'll try to go to bed before 3 a.m. Or Rose, she's probably like, I just want to go to sleep, and these ladies are. Rose's like, what? <laughs> Taking their sweet time. Yeah, Rose, Let's don't see. feel obligated to sit here with us the whole time because, yeah. you know, we obviously need some help. <laughs> we can do it. I'll at least make sure I get done. Okay, Rose. Be posy. Match. Put this here and see if this will work. Probably not because it's on the crease. Because I'm being a dork. Because you know I don't have nothing better to do. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, Laryl's talking to herself. Please help her. I'm just causing myself lots of stress. That's all. It is boring. Leafa said a suggestion if you wanted to read it, Laurel. What'd she say? She or Leafa made a suggestion. Yes, Leafa. Laurel, now you could do like Aunt Angie, except to slide pick in, but it till you get the pick. Maybe tags and put things for baby on tags. Yeah. Keep going too far down with this material. And it's in the fold, and I just don't understand how to work around this fold. Well, if we remember right, Rose's was really flat, and I think we're very dimensional people. Yeah, time. we're very dimensional. Like, it's really hard for me to, like, keep it flat. Worry about the yeah. flat. Piece. Yeah, exactly. But it's very, I think it's possible. But it works, though. I mean, just... Yeah. If, if you keep your stuff where it's squishable, not squishable, but, you know. Has yeah, some I mean, there's plenty of room in here for dimension. Yeah. Okay, Rose. What'd she say? She asked me to zoom in a little bit. I know my desk is a mess, too. How's that? Ask Rose oh, yeah. how that is. Have you seen my I'm desk? Rose. That's good. Does that work? Yeah. Okay. Period. Anything for Rosie Posey? Is that better? Rose? Oh, thank you, Rose. Here, you want to see it more? I'm doing mine kind of like collage pockets and stuff. And then there's the front. Yes, I, you know, I never knew my style. And I, I agree, very, very vintage, tattered, rustic, grungy. <laughs> Craziness. 
Yeah, I considered mine very vintage, tattered, you know. Yeah, like, yeah, exactly. But I guess it has a little bit of shabby chic in it. Yeah, and shabby, too. It's, it's like, I don't even know what it is. It just happens, I guess. It's like pretty meets... Tore up. <laughs> <laughs> pretty meets torn up. <laughs> <laughs> it is, though, kind of. Mine's probably more like a, you know, more like a what, like a junk journal maybe. For the fact that it doesn't have any, you know, it's just pictures. Let's see where the oh, there it went. Okay, so I got that. My two pockets. Mine's not anything. Yet. It's coming though. It's coming along. It's coming along. It's coming to a YouTube near you. <laughs> oh. So my daughter went from, what is her name that played in burlesque? Someone help me out. Uh, it's been so long, I don't remember. Um, oh, I'm thinking of Mulan. Well, she went from that to Queen. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Hold on, I'm gonna go close my door for a minute. Okay. Galileo, 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 Galileo. Yeah. Uh, Rose says we're doing fine. Oh, thank you, Rosie Posey. If you say so, Rose. If you say so, Rose. Oh, Laurel, we love how positive she is. Don't you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love this new side of you. <laughs> Like I was telling the Anastasia, sometimes I put it down and then got to rip it all up. <laughs> yeah. I wasn't kidding. Yeah, she told you. Throw it across the floor, maybe just a little bit. I like to stay in the edges, too. I think, is that what you're doing, too, Laura? Or are you tattering? Me? Oh, oh that's me. I know that's, that's Sierra. Not me. I'm inking the edges of everything. I know you can hear me inking the edges more than you can hear me uh, talking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gosh. It's okay, though. Let's see. My ink edge inker is louder than my vocal cords. Hmm. I'm getting somewhere, Rose. I feel the end is near. We're getting there, Rose. We're on top of it, Rose. We're on top of it. We're getting her done. Getting her done. We're on top of it, Rose. So I'll go ahead and switch to me to show you all what I'm doing. Again, if you don't mind. Okay. Nope. Be my guest. Laurel, everything I see you make is always beautiful. See? Lift, lift, 
Nifa has faith in you, my dear. Oh, thank you, Lifa. I'm trying so, to have faith in myself right now. <laughs> yes, keep your faith strong. Okay, so I pulled out, I have, there's buttons in this kit, guys. And then I pull out a couple extra buttons. And what am I going to do? Make a button card. <laughs> what do you know? My go-to. <laughs> I love making me some button cards. I've yet to make a button card. I love making button cards. I don't know why. <laughs> I love making oh, button cards. And so I'm going to use the beautiful tags that Rose provided to make button card or button cards. There's going to be two heart button cards, and I'm getting everything all tangled up. Dang it. Okay. Two button cards for the hearts, and then I'm going to make the other two tags uh, um, The other two tags are going to be hold the seam binding that I don't use that I am or the one seam binding that I'm not going to use on the project because I don't there you go. I'm not using that color so I'm making me a button card so I got the oops so you can see what I'm trying to do Oh, geez, Louise, dear. Is it Laurel is the one who likes the fussy cut? Yes. Ugh, why? I don't why know. I just me? do. Oh, no. See, this, this um, string does not like me when I'm making button cards with it. I do not know why at all. So I'm just sewing the buttons on this card see you can see and so here's one of roses oopsie daisy yeah. oopsie daisy who said that <laughs> what else am i supposed to say huh he's like oopsie daisy, daisy. <laughs> oopsie yeah, daisy. I'm, not, I'm not tired leaf i'm just i'm kind of aggravated so uh, it's not helping my creative process because I'm think I'm making things more difficult than they are, and then my creative part of my brain just kind of shuts off, and that annoys me. Yeah, throw it down, throw, start throwing stuff down. I am. That's what I'm doing. Because she gave us all the good. It's all full of good materials. Mm hmm. Oh, I'm not saying there's any, there's nothing wrong with this. Kit. Oh, I know. It's just my oh, I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. I know that. Okay. Getting there. I wasn't trying to say that you said that at all. Um, all right. That's that one. Uh oh. What? What is that? What? What was that? What are you talking about? Hello. Are you guys still there? Yeah. Laurel, McFly. Hello, McFly. <laughs> Are you there? Is anybody there? Hello. I'm here. Can you hear me? Yeah, I'm here. Did she? Okay. Is the, did she go? I don't know. <laughs> I, I'm like, trying. Uh -oh. I don't know if you guys Lorel? can hear me because. Oh, there we are. We got you. Are we losing Ciara? Are we losing me? Uh, no, we're here. <laughs> no, we're here. Oh, here. Uh, 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 uh. oh, gosh. On me? Is that me? <laughs> That's the going at uh, oh, oh. Um, I'm here. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Can you hear me? <laughs> Hello? What is going on? Is there anybody there? Can you hear me? Hello. 
We're here, Laurel. I'm here. Okay, we're here too. Laurel, can you hear me? Yeah, now I Andy. can. Andy, you were can you sounding hear me? really weird. Yes, I can hear you, Sarah. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> I'm so confused. We were confused too. Oh us. my God, what is going on? It may be a full moon tonight or something. Hello. <laughs> I don't think I don't think Laurel can hear us. I can hear you. Can you hear me? Oh, yeah. Okay, I couldn't hear you for quite a while. All I could hear oh. was like, eh, 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 eh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what anyone was saying or anything. Ooh. Yeah, it's super bad weather here, too. So <laughs> Angie's probably the only one who you can actually hear correctly. Oh, I can hear you fine now. Okay, good. I can hear everybody fine right now. Angie, I can always hear fine, but I Laurel sometimes cuts out, but Angie, I can always hear. Oh, you should have heard what you sounded like. <laughs> oh, I know. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Angie's probably the one that. I'm good to go. <laughs> has yeah, the best connection or whatever. And she's uh, in the mountains. Yep. Right. You know? Yeah. Go I figure. spend, we spend like, we have like the business account for, for high speed. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> well, that explains it. That explains it all. She's, she's a cheater. She has a business account. Yeah, it was for my business, uh, my husband's business when he was contracted. Oh, yeah. But we kept it. Pen. My pen. My pen. My pen. My pen. Where did you blow my pen? Where she blow? Oh, that's it. Oh. Too much stuff on my desk. All right, it got a little quiet. What? Got a little quiet. <laughs> we're supposed to be talking. We're in a live show here, ladies. You're supposed yeah. to be telling them what we're doing. We're all concentrating that we're not explaining to anybody what we're doing at all. Well, ladies, I have laid down fabric and ripped it up three times. So that's why well, I can teach you how to lay down fabric and rip it back up. <laughs> And now I'm continuing to lay down seam binding. Let's see how this works out. And I am just putting together my little collages. Would you like to explain the process? Um, first, I cut it out of the paper. And then I put some, uh, I used some Arosa. She included some of this um, felt on the back of this lady. Uh, just to give she it I don't know just gives some dimension and then I'm gonna I cut up a piece of her fabric and I'm gonna put it back here. And then I'm gonna take her little bits that she's got here and put I think I'm gonna put a flower. She glued these little tiny itty bitty clay flowers and then on this rose so far I just um wrapped a piece of lace around that. Oh how pretty! Pretty pretty and I think I'm going to put this on top of here. Like this. Aww. And the rose. So that will that be one little awesome. collage piece. That looks awesome. I love it. Thank you. Sierra, are you still with us? Yeah. I'm uh, making some love buttons. My some buttons are full of love. Oh, yeah, hey, Misty. Some. Misty's here. Hi, Misty. How oh, are you? The party can get started, Misty. Misty, keep the chat going, would you? Can you make everybody laugh? Yeah. <laughs> Please, we we're, appreciate we're, we're doing a really poor job of it tonight. <laughs> yeah. See, I made some love buttons. Love buttons? Love buttons. Oh, cute. I love that. I love I that. Love buttons. And uh, so those are going to go in that pocket. 
And then these are going to be, what kind of button should I call these ones? Mm, joy. Joy buttons. Bountiful buttons. Bountiful buttons. Yeah, I like that. Bountiful. How do you spell bountiful? <laughs> B-O-U-N-T-I-F-U-L. Okay, one second. B-O-U-N-T-I-F-U-L. I although it could F be I, yeah I F U L U L no. bountiful buttons. Misty, we're working on a kit. Uh, Rose, Rosie Posey in here um, designed a kit, and. Um, I purchased one and the other girls did too. So this is what this is what the kit is. It's a flip book or box, right? Box, flip, flip box. box, flip box, flip box, box. Sorry, box. And I am making a tag or a button card for bountiful buttons. I like yeah, it's mine. really cool to work with. It's actually a lot of fun. And <laughs> I am making a big, huge mess. I think Angie's a laughaholic. I am. I am a laughaholic for sure. <laughs> and, uh, and that will always be me. Know. <laughs> Laurel's a wineaholic. <laughs> Laurel's like, thanks. <laughs> Love you too. No, she's a she's a perfectionist aholic. That's what Laurel is. She's too much of a perfectionist. Yeah, sometimes I get like that too, but. Oh, me too. Me too. Or three or four. Or five or six. Five or six, seven. So I'm making. My bountiful buttons. Bounty for buttons. It was the dictionary. Um, definition for bountiful. Not me. I don't know what it is. Uh, a ton or a lot. Plenty of, yeah. Um, you don't have to look it up, honey. Don't I'm not worry. looking it up. Sugar pie, honey. Pie. So Misty, did dude rip your house up again? <laughs> I saw him uh, doing laundry with you today. <laughs> oh, gosh, he's a little. He's so funny. Oh boy, he loves, like I'm loves gonna it. take this laundry basket and set it on my head. He loves to take everything apart. <laughs> At least he's not a man he takes apart like the toaster and stuff. Oh my gosh. My husband likes to take everything apart. And... So does mine. He thinks he can put it all back together, but he doesn't know, doesn't know how to. Yeah, Misty. So this is Rose's Rosie Posey's flip box kit. And it oh you guys, I forgot you were on me. Son of a gun. Um 
It's full of lots of embellishments and yummies. And it's $25, including shipping. Mm -hmm. Which is awesome. For sure. Good deal. I'm trying to find... Oh, there, that's not down. I saw that sucker over there. So, yeah, it comes with a lot of uh, little trinkets and buttons and trims and lace. Little flowers and... Little tiny flowers. Yeah, if you're interested in seeing what's in the kit, you can go to the beginning of the... Beginning of the... Um, video. Video. Or you can go to Laurel's channel and she has a full... Um, a full tutorial or full show showing it. <laughs> She's a full on. Show. Oh my gosh, Laurel! You know what? I've had enough of your. Oh my gosh! And I love listening to you, Sierra. <laughs> well, I'm trying to talk and do something at the same time. What do you expect? Okay, I have one, t one. Whatever, one person in your. Oh, here's Brandy. Hey, Brandy. What happened? Her power's out, but she wanted to pop in for a few. Been missing all of you. Oh, shoot. Um. Oh, shoot. What? what? My. Oh, this the main thing the main thing went off what what main thing went off uh the main person the person that holds the channel my laptop i'm watching it on youtube well it's going to turn off any second uh oh so if i don't get this back up then this show's going to end in like 5 seconds Hurry up. well it gives you time to come back on i'm trying all right, guys, we're having some tough, te technical. We're having some technical, <laughs> some technical difficulties. So, if we should go away for a minute, just stay here. We'll be back. Just wait longer. <laughs> we're not back in five minutes. Just wait longer. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know, as Sierra said, we're staying on until we get this sucker done. <laughs> What's going on? What is happening? Yeah, because it's a... Let's see if I can open it. Hopefully I can open well, it. I don't see it going off yet. Well, it will go off in five minutes if we don't get back on the, uh, the beginning guy. Leaf is like, I thought you said testicle. <laughs> you bag. Oh, we love our Leafa. No testicles here. No. We be women. We be women. No mountain oysters here. Brandy's like, if it's all right with you, Ciara and Laurel, I'd love to do a video or live making it. That's fine. It's your kit. You can do what you want. You can go live or make a video. Well, show. Do you have your kit? No, Brandy? not yet. Oh, brother. Uh. Misty says, Angie, I got a brother sewing machine. <gasps> you did? Well, you have my address. And she says she never knows what she's walking into when she comes to our shows. <laughs> <laughs> right? All I did was purchase the kit. And I'm like, hey, let's do it together. I was like, hey, let's do it. I've never done it. What are we doing? I got the kit, but I don't even know what it is. Because I didn't get to watch, well, I watched the beginning, so they helped me figure it out, and now I'm just kind of rolling with it. That's awesome, Misty. I can't wait. You're going to be sewing up paper all night, I have a feeling. 
We can sit together on uh, Skype, Misty, and sew because I've been sewing it up lately too. Yeah, Laurel's got some something coming up. Yep, I do. It's top secret. This is going to turn off any minute, just so you guys know. No, don't let it turn off. I'm trying, I'm trying to fix it. You didn't get it yet? No. I don't know what the heck is happening. <laughs> this is quite, quite the night. I'm telling you. Now my daughter's listening to Walking in a Winter Wonderland. <laughs> probably because oh, she's, yeah. she's tired of listening to us. <laughs> she's just driving her car. She's wishing it was still Christmas, I'm sure. Aww. She just love, love, loves Christmas. I like Christmas too. So do I. She would like it to be Christmas all the time. I can't even switch who it's looking at right now. <laughs> 